I'm Senator Matt Clayman. One of the most important parts of my work as your Senator is listening to you. Every year, our office sends out a constituent survey, and I always enjoy hearing from West Anchorage friends and neighbors. This year, we received over 440 responses to our survey. As always, balancing Alaska's budget remains a top issue. A balanced budget must determine how to fund essential services, including public safety and public education, whether to collect new revenue and the permanent fund dividend. 82% of survey respondents believe we should not pay a statutory dividend, which would be about $3,400 this year. 74% support using permanent fund earnings to help pay for essential services. Only 13% opted for substantial budget cuts to state services, with most opting for limited or moderate cuts. And 75% said they support moderate or substantial new taxes. The most popular option for new revenue was a state sales tax and a state income tax. This year, with substantial budget discussions about education funding, we asked about education funding priorities. The highest priority was to improve teacher recruitment and retention, followed by inflation-proofing education funding and expanding career and technical education. Increased accountability through student testing ranked last. We also asked about Governor Dunleavy's proposed budget for FY 2025, which flat funds public services, pays a statutory dividend, and leaves us with a $1 billion deficit to be paid from state savings. 75% of respondents gave that budget a failing grade. And finally, 72% of West Anchorage constituents support returning to a pension retirement program for public employees. This year, the Senate passed Senate Bill 88, which would do just that. To see a full summary of the survey responses, please visit my website. Thanks again to all who responded. It helps to know our community values and priorities.